it's just wonderful to see all these wonderful old traditions being kept alive. It's, and the kid, great for the kids to see it, because we've just sat and watched a guy make a bucket, which they were in awe of. Yeah, it's beautiful. I really love it. Absolutely love it. You know, you don't see a lot of this stuff anymore, and yeah, I've played around with a bit of this stuff myself, and it's just brilliant. Drove all the way from Gippsland to come and have a look at the trade show here, and it's fantastic. I'm, I'm with two blokes. We're totally loving it. I've lost them. So they're, they're fascinated with what's around. They're woodworkers and metal workers themselves, so they really appreciate some of the old arts being retrieved here. I've actually come to see uh, a penny farthing. I have a, um, a ride on a penny farthing on my bucket list. So I thought, I'll find somebody who knows something about it and I'll come and talk to them and who knows, tick it off. Thank you, hold your position, hold your positions. You. Well, I mean, it's, as no wonder it's the old, um, arts and crafts or old skills because yeah stuff like that is just fantastic I mean you're, you always wonder how they do stuff like that and now you see it you know live in the flesh yeah no it's just fascinating. I think my favourite bit so far would be the barrel maker I forgot his name but um, he's been doing this since he was 15 years old and he's 68 I think and just the um, incredible amount of skill and craft that he has um, in that just amazing how he is so quick at these little things that would take anybody else a long time. Pretty sick seeing how they made some of the stuff back then compared to all the machines that they use now to put it all together. But um, yeah, no, this is the first time I've been here, but I'll be coming back next year. Oh, it's been great today, actually, really, because it's, it's sort of demonstrating the, you know, the arts that we had two, three, four hundred years ago, which you don't see anymore. And a lot of these people who are making this sort of stuff would find it very difficult to get a market. Mm. So this is a great way of showing off what they can do. Well, I enjoy woodwork. That's the most thing I do because I'm a carver myself. But seeing uh, some of the professionalism here, uh, I'm knowing in that stakes. <laughs> so no, it's pretty fabulous. It's been a fabulous day. I bought a hoe, I've got a few weeds around the garden and I figured this might help me um, deal with them. And um, it's great, oh, there's just so much to see here. Uh, yeah, and um, like blacksmithing's fantastic and um, yeah, it's really refreshing to see all these different arts um, that you would have thought are gone by the wayside. So yeah, good day.